Hey everyone, welcome to Sideshow's First Look. Today we'll be checking out the Tech 6 skill figure by Hot Toys from Star Wars The Bad Batch. The box features a dominant image of Tech armored up and packing a brace of blasters, with two more images showing off the portrait on the show-specific decorative band. And lifting the top off of that box reveals a gorgeous montage of Tech doing his thing while Hunter and Wrecker play with a battle droid in the background. Removing that insert fully reveals the Tech 6 scale figure, as well as an array of character-specific accessories at rest in a single plastic tray. Here's absolutely everything that comes with the Tech figure, which you can see standing there in the center on top of a thematic display base with a metallic nameplate. On the right, you can see Tech's massive backpack with a pair of antennae, Tech's signature goggles, his helmet, a pair of thermal detonators, one standard and one in a mine configuration, a holster, and a pair of DC-17 hand blasters. Over on the left, you'll spot a data pad, a swap-out topper for the base, a quartet of tools, and a series of swap-out hands, including a pair of trigger hands, a pair of gripping hands, and a gesturing hand. The Tech figure stands at just over 12 inches in overall height and comes girded for combat in a customized set of combat armor that's as distinctive when compared to mainline clone armor as the batch is from Rex. The base color of Tech's armor is noticeably whiter than that of the rest of the batch, strategically accented with splashes of red and gray, which are in turn overlaid with the various insignia of Clone Force 99. A mixed-media utility harness drops from the belt at the waist with multiple loops for storing tools, and another group of pouches are strapped to the armor on the lower legs. The portrait is an excellent real-world realization of the animated equivalent, featuring a modified likeness to that of Tamora Morrison in his role as every clone in the saga. A hint of a five o'clock shadow accents the cheeks and jawline, and the detail in the irises of brown eyes as brown eyes pops from beneath the high forehead and swept back brown hair. Tech signature goggles come separately in the packaging and can be added to the figure thusly, completing the look of the character as he's always seen in the show. The helmet can be disassembled by popping off the side elements and splitting the helmet like so. Once that's done, simply reverse the process to add the helmet to Tech's portrait, rendering him fully combat ready. That helmet is also chuffed and weathered with an antenna jutting skyward from either side and a translucent yellow visor that can be articulated into position over Tech's eyes. Lifting the flap on the right van brace exposes the built-in data pad there, and the portable data pad will comfortably rest in either of the two relaxed hands. This holster will protect one of the pistols when they're not being wielded, and can be mounted to the utility harness on the left leg like so, and both of the pistols and either of the thermal detonators can be carried in hands specifically engineered to that end. Each of the tools splits into two pieces, allowing them to be installed in the loops on the leg harness like so, with the torch going on the right leg and the remaining three tools on the left. The base features a Starship deck theme at the top, and adding this Clone Force 99 theme topper to it will add some Bad Batch specific flair to your display. The tech figure features over 30 points of articulation, each with a remarkable range of motion, allowing the figure to be posed up in a variety of positions, providing collectors with ample opportunities to recreate their favorite scenes from the show. This has been Sideshow's first look at the tech six skill figure by Hot Toys from Star Wars The Bad Batch. For more information about this figure, or to check out the wide assortment of Star Wars collectibles available from Hot Toys, follow the link below. Thank you for watching our video, and as always, don't forget to let your geek sideshow.